All right, what is up you guys? It's Katya Bulks. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new, hello. Click that subscribe button. Join the fit fam. Ugh, something in my eye. I think I'm good. But otherwise, yes, I've brought for you guys another protein review and I'm so excited, as I always say, for this review because not that it's the brand or anything, but the flavors. When I got this like email info about it, I was freaked out because I was like, oh my gosh, this is the first vegan protein to come out with red velvet protein powder. It's nothing more exciting, like at least for me. Um, it was a thing that you could get like free samples, pay for shipping and handling, whatever. But I also then chose the cookies and cream. The, oh, by the way, Plant Fusion is the brand. So they changed up their label a bit. I have tried them in the past. And from what I do remember is it was kind of chalky, the texture. So hopefully they revamped it. But yes, I'm gonna quickly read calories and stuff. I'm gonna try the cooking cream now and then post-workout the red velvet cake. Save the best for last, right? So they have the same macros, so and which is 100, I think they have the same macros? Yeah, 120 calories, three fat, two carbs, and 21 protein, pretty awesome. And it's got a good amino acid infused protein blend. It's got even an enzyme blend for digestion, so that's pretty cool. All right, I'm gonna mix up cookies and cream, and we're gonna try it out. Ah, almost fell over, okay. That smelled really good when I was putting the powder in. So, let's see how it is. It looks like it mixed well. Okay, not bad, but not immediately, like I wouldn't guess that it's cookies and cream. Like, mm, like it reminds me more of the taste of just the cookie part of a cookies and cream cookie, like an Oreo cookie. So I don't get as much, I don't know, maybe it should be a little more vanilla-y? I don't know how to describe it. It's not too, too bad. I mean, it's not bad, but it's not like amazing where I'd buy a tub of it, but they definitely improved the texture. The texture is great, smooth. I like it. I mean, I get a good subtle chocolate flavor in it. I mean, let's see. Cocoa, natural flavor, stevia. Yeah, so they don't have anything other than stevia. I don't know what natural flavors is. I wish they would just like put whatever regular flavors. Like, it just doesn't make sense. So I don't know what could possibly, but maybe add a little vanilla or something they could adjust. I don't know. I don't know how to make cookies and cream flavor. Maybe one day I'll come out with my own protein and I will just like make bomb ass flavors. But as for now, I won't be coming out with one anytime soon. Unless you guys want to support that. Hey. Um, but for reals, I'm gonna go work out. I'm gonna finish this because it's it is pretty darn good. And then we will come back and try the red velvet. Yes. See you guys. Okay, so it's time to try. I was gonna say all right, and then I said okay, so it was like okay. That was weird. But yeah, red velvet time. And oh hey, huh? My beanie kind of matches, so that's perfect. And then, yeah, perfect for the season. Oh my gosh, I did not even plan that, literally. Um, now that it's fall season, beanies are back, and I'm so happy. So, yes, I'm gonna open up the red velvet cake, and we're gonna try it. Got high hopes, high hopes, you guys. Right, man, if money was no option, I would just be forever a taste tester of proteins or something. That should just be my job. Hire me, I don't know. But yeah, look at that nice color. It, it's got that good red velvety color. It smelled good. Let's see if it tastes good. Mmm. Okay, yeah, that's really good, you guys. Mm-hmm, mm. That tastes like red velvet. Whereas the cookies and cream was like, okay, it tastes a lot of cookies, not as much cream. Oh yeah, hell yeah. This tastes like red velvet. Oh man, I'm digging this so much. That would taste so good to make a shake with, with like almond milk. 
but with just water it mixes perfectly I even forgot the shaker ball but they must have changed up their formula because it's not chalky whatsoever it is so good so yeah I totally totally recommend it mm. okay guys as you saw these proteins turn protein batters turned out to be pretty solid the red velvet being the winner and I'm so happy because I only got this one because I was by getting this one because it was pick two, you get a free, whatever. But shoot, that really exceeded my expectations. Cookies and cream. Okay. So, but I would totally recommend the red velvet cake. So, if you ever have the opportunity and you want to give a good protein a try, hell yeah, go for that one. Otherwise, if you enjoyed this review, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe so you can check out all my other videos. Enjoy the Fit Fam, you know. Why not? Go check out the other videos. I'll put the playlist link thing above if you want to go see the other protein reviews, all supplement reviews, anything I haven't tried out, you know, comment that below if you've got questions, comments, concerns. I don't know. You can comment that below. Otherwise, if you want to just say hi, I'll respond to you because I love you all. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Have a good night. Get those gains. Boom. See ya.